Topsy and Tim Make a New Friend by Jean and Gareth Adamson Topsy and Tim were playing in the park when they met a little girl in a wheelchair. Hello, said Topsy. What's your name? I'm Jenny, said the little girl shyly. We're Topsy and Tim, and we're twins, said Topsy. I like your wheelchair, Jenny, said Tim. What makes it go? Guess, said Jenny. Mmm, a battery? guessed Tim. Jenny laughed. No, she said. I turned the wheels with my hands. I'm very strong. Jenny whisked her wheelchair along with Aunt Topsy and Tim raced after her. Their mom sat on a bench and watched. Careful, Topsy and Tim, called Mommy. When it was time to go home, Topsy and Tim waved goodbye to their new friend. See you again soon, Jenny! called Topsy. When Topsy and Tim arrived at school on Monday morning, Miss Terry said, A new girl is coming to join us today. Her name is Jenny, and she uses a wheelchair. Topsy and Tim guessed that Jenny might be their friend from the park. Why does Jenny use a wheelchair? asked Vinda. Because her legs don't work properly, said Miss Terry. When a part of someone's body or brain doesn't work properly, we say they have a disability. Can anyone think of more disabilities? asked Miss Terry. My uncle's deaf, so he wears a hearing aid to help him hear, said Tony Welch. My eyes need glasses to help me see properly, said Stevie Dunton. Some grown-ups who can't see have a guide dog to help them, said Topsy. Andy Anderson shut his eyes and tried to walk across the room, but he soon bumped into a table. Everyone laughed at Andy, except Miss Terry. It's very unkind to laugh at or to tease someone who is different, said Miss Terry. I hope you children will never, never do such an unkind thing. We won't promised all the children. When Jenny arrived with her classroom helper, all the children came to say hello. Jenny was feeling shy, so she was glad to see Topsy and Tim's friendly faces. Miss Terry asked the twins to look after Jenny, as she was new. Topsy and Tim showed Jenny around the classroom. We keep our things in these drawers, said Tim. This one is mine. One of the drawers had a new label. It said, Jenny. Here's my drawer, said Jenny. Topsy and Tim took Harriet Hamster out of her cage to show Jenny. Would you like to weigh her? asked Topsy. Jenny put Harriet on the scales. She weighs 100 grams, said Tim. The bell rang, and it was time for a break. Carrie held the door wide open for Jenny and her wheelchair. Topsy and Tim showed the way to the ramp that led to the playground. Jenny whisked down the ramp in her wheelchair. After break, Miss Terry said, Harriet hey, Hamster has escaped from her cage. Someone left the cage door open. It was Topsy and me, said Tim sadly. We were showing Harry to Jenny. Everyone, please keep a lookout for Harriet, said Miss Terry. It was time to do some number work. I've forgotten what four looks like, said Topsy. Jenny wrote a figure four. I remember, said Topsy. Jenny was good at numbers. At lunchtime, all the children had to go and wash their hands. I've got my own special toilet, with a wash basin, said Jenny. She showed it to Topsy and Tim. 
It's big enough for Jenny's wheelchair, too, explained Sue the helper. Afternoon lessons began with P.E., and Jenny joined in everything. She rolled around the hall in her wheelchair. Ouch, said Andy Anderson. Jenny's wheelchair trod on my toe. The afternoon ended quietly, with Miss Terry reading a story to the children. They all sat on the carpet, listening, and Jenny sat on the carpet too. Mr. Taylor, the head teacher, came into the classroom to see how Jenny was getting on. He was surprised to see her empty wheelchair. Where is Jenny? he asked. She's here with us, said Tim, waving to Mr. Taylor. Jenny got out of her wheelchair all by herself, said Topsy. I can get back into my wheelchair all by myself too, said Jenny. Everyone watched while Jenny wriggled across the floor and pulled herself up into her chair. It was hard work and it took a long time, but in the end, she did it. Well done, Jenny, said Mr. Taylor, and everybody clapped. They all felt very proud of Jenny. At home time, Jenny's mother came into the classroom. She found Jenny with a big smile on her face. Hello, Mom. She said, this is my drawer, and look what I found in it. Jenny opened her drawer, and up popped her hamster. Hooray! shouted Topsy and Tim. Jenny's found her hamster! The end.